Hello and welcome to the video tutorial on Electrical Calculation Tools, ECT. This video gives an overview of the Electrical Calculation Tools, ECT application and an understanding of selectivity. In this demonstration, you will view a basic introduction to the Electrical Calculation Tools, ECT application, applicable areas and benefits of using electrical calculation tools, how to access electrical calculation tools and check selectivity, and how to obtain selectivity results. Electrical Calculation Tools is a suite of online tools for quick protection device selection, selectivity checking, and cable calculations. This online electrical calculation tool is helpful to make a quick reference and verification. Using these online tools, you can design a new installation, expand existing installation, or perform maintenance. Electrical Calculation Tools is a set of computer-aided online tools designed to help you display the time current curves of 1 to 8 protective devices, check the selectivity between two protective devices and display their time current curves, search all the protective devices that can be selective with a defined protective device, search all the protective devices that offer cascading with a defined protective device. Display the curves of two residual current devices, RCD, and check their selectivity. Check selectivity of MV-LV protection devices. Calculate the cross-section area of cables and build a cable schedule. Calculate the voltage drop of a defined cable and check the maximum length. To access the online electrical calculations tools, use the given link. This will open up the home page from where you can start using the application. Let's begin by understanding how to check display curves of two protection devices and check their selectivity. On the home page, select the Protection tab and then click the Check Selectivity tab. Select the Hide Obsoleted Products checkbox. Then select the Phase to Phase Voltage from the dropdown. Let's select the voltage as 400 volts. Choose the type of standard, whether industrial or domestic. Select the Add Curve tab and choose the primary protection device, either a circuit breaker or fuse. Note that once you select the primary protection device, you need to define few device parameters as per the project needs. Let's proceed to set device parameters for the primary protection device. Begin by selecting the range. Let's choose this as Master Packed NW. Next, select the circuit breaker. Define the ampere rating of the circuit breaker. Then select Pole from the drop down based on project parameters. Select the trip unit from the drop down. Define the trip unit rating. Note that the tool will automatically calculate the braking capacity based on the selections made. Next, you need to choose the second protection device to calculate selectivity. Select the Add Curve tab and choose the second protection device. In this case, we will select a circuit breaker. Now, define the device parameters. Let's choose the range as Compact NSX with a circuit breaker NSX 630F. Select the ampere rating as 630 amperes. Then, choose the poles. Let the trip unit be MicroLogic 2.3 with a trip rating selection of 630 amperes. Note that the braking capacity is calculated automatically. Once you have made all the selections and defined the devices, let's proceed with the selectivity result. To get the selectivity results, click on the Check Selectivity tab. If device settings are adjustable, you can make changes. You can view and change the settings based on which curve gets updated. Once the settings are adjusted, do not forget to save the configuration using the lock option. Similarly, you can add a third protection device to check selectivity. Like this, you can add up to eight devices. 
all the curves and settings will appear in a single panel. Any changes made to the settings will reflect in the curve. You can generate a report either as PDF or doc format and save it on your computer. Provide all the details and select the type of document to be saved in the computer. Then click Generate. The report shows the result with curves of the protection, the protection device description, and the setting values used for analysis. This concludes the video on Electrical Calculation Tools ECT. In this video, we saw a basic introduction to the Electrical Calculation Tools ECT application, applicable areas and benefits of using electrical calculation tools, how to access electrical calculation tools and check selectivity, and how to obtain selectivity results. Thank you.